I would like to <coughs> I would like to read a uh, uh, Psalms 8 uh, I'm reading an IV version uh, we all can read together <coughs> Lord our Lord how majestic is your name in all the earth you have set your glory in the heavens through the praise of children and infants, you have established a stronghold against your enemies to silence the foe and the avenger. When I consider your heavens, the works of your fingers, the moon and the stars, which you have set in place, what is mankind that you are mindful of them, human being that you care for them? You have made them a little lower than the angels and crowned them with the glory and honor. You made them rulers over the works of your hands. You put everything under their feet. All folks, flocks and herds and the animals of the wild, the bird in the sky and the fish in the sea, all that swim the paths of the sea. Lord, our Lord, how majestic is your name in all the earth. Praise the Lord. <coughs> I thank Lord for uh, this uh, wonderful morning. God has given us to come to his presence, worship him with the truth and spirit. <coughs> uh, so you, we all are uh, reaching at the end of this uh, year. This is the last Sunday of this year. And uh, uh, God given us one more chance to come to his presence to praise him and worship him and i thank lord for that i humble once again i i thank lord's provisions and i thank lord lord for his cares and uh thank for uh, his love and his mercy uh to me and uh, towards my family so i <coughs> uh, just want to go into the um the psalms i read that we read uh, Psalms 8. Uh, we all know that you know that this Psalms is uh, written by David, uh, and uh, there's a, a three main points or uh, there's a theme uh, you know, of the Psalm is there's three points. That's the first point is uh, the the universe, the works of the Lord is declare the glory of God, and the second one is. Uh, the authority and the power God given to men. And the third point is He is worthy to be praised in all the earth, the, all the creations and, the, uh, and the, uh, all the earth and the, all the heavens should praise Him. He is worthy to be praised. <clears throat> uh, let me, I, I, I just want to focus on. Uh, Two, three words that uh, from verse four to six. That's what uh, uh, I wanted to focus on today. Uh, as you all know that, you know, they, uh, uh, David was a uh, shepherd boy. Uh, he's, he's tending his uh, uh, father's sheep into the forest. And uh, he look at the sky and he look at the world. He look at the universe. Uh, and he seeing that uh, magnificent creation of God the skies, moons and stars and the galaxy, he felt very insignificant and wondered <clears throat> why the creator God would care about human. When he looked at that, God has wonderfully made everything. Then he, he felt that, you know, he's very small, he's very in insignificant uh, to remember God, to remember him. Uh, so maybe he, he's asking himself that, you know, why God, why you care about me? So many times, you know, we also ask that same question. Do I matter when we go through our situations, when our, our, our the, uh, the, the valley of uh, uh, shadow, valley of death, valley of sickness, and the circumstances comes like that. We, all, we also ask that, you know, do I matter? We'll, we'll see that answer in, in, in the coming words. <clears throat> God has shown his care for humans in several ways. For example, 
like uh, like the modern parents we all know that you know when uh, uh, the modern parents they before they're going to get a have a baby they buy their stuff uh, they, they buy the cribs they buy uh, toys and they buy all the stuff it's, uh, some of them you know separate a room for them and they created uh, decorated uh, for them that's the way the same way uh, God created a planet for his children our first two parents Adam and Eve we have the generation of uh, Adam and Eve so he made everything before the uh, God created uh, the human being <clears throat> the Sun moon stars lights uh, 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 Sun moon and stars for, 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 for their lights and the trees for their food and even he made air condition uh, earth that to live uh, in a in a better way so he provided abundantly uh, for the mankind and also give and, and also give the dominion and uh, authority over all the living creatures on the earth because he cares for them he cares for them he, he loves loves them many of time you know we don't understand uh, that or we, we, we don't accept that uh, accept that truth that God is providing all this to us but uh, uh, <clears throat> but the Bible clearly teaches us that uh, we are not here in an accident uh, many th many times people don't uh, the people who don't believe in God people don't trust in God you know they, they, they ask this question too why? why why do I matter so they believe that you know they are here uh, in a chance they came here is a as, as an accident but uh, the Bible <coughs> excuse me <coughs> Bible clearly says that uh, we are not here by chance or here here we are an accident in Genesis 126 says God created man uh, he, uh, by his own uh, in, in his own image and likeness so so they may rule over the fish in the sea and the birds in the sky over the livestock and uh, all the wild animals and all the creatures that move along the ground so we are created by a plan by our created and uh, created with a purpose we are valuable because God created us God created many things and everything but only human is made in a, in the image of uh, image of uh, image and the likeness of God so we are special and unique in God's eyes he, he looks at us as his holy dearly loved, loved children praise the Lord so he cares for us he loves us we are his creation we are already uh, think thought about that you know other day while we are uh, talking about the uh, uh, celebration of Jesus birth he created us in his own image and likeness <clears throat> I want to go go through the next verse uh, five you have made them a little lower than the angels and crowned them with the glory and honor you made them rulers over the works of your hands. You put everything under their feet. Uh, again, David was considering him, uh, consider his smallness in the vastness of the uh, universe. When he feels very small, and when you look at the, the vast universe, you know, he feels that again it's small. But uh, it says, you made them a little lower than the angels the word in Hebrew to describe us as being a little lower than the heavenly being is the word is used Elohim the word Elohim denotes God or the word used instead of God in uh, when we, you can see that in Old Testament more than 2,000 times the same word is used that denotes God so we have been created in the image of God 
and are to live our lives as people who were created just as little lower than God. Look at us, how greatly and magnificently he, God created us and uh, he gave the authority and uh, power to us. Uh, most of the time, you know, we, we, we look at the other side of our life in a human being, how, how, uh, uh, how uh, fertile uh, 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 we are, very, very, we are very mortal uh, people. In Job uh, chapter 4, uh, verse 19 and 20, we read that, you know, we look at our, uh, uh, we say that, in you know, a human is like, uh, it's a mortal man and we are like a moth. And Psalms 39 5 says that everyone is everyone is but a birth, even those who seem secure. Yes, when the, when the, when the, when the, the even though David and uh, Job and uh, they all are uh, uh, trust in the uh, trust in the Lord and uh, uh, they were uh, God's children, God's people. But you know when the when the situations the circumstances came into their life they they felt that you know that you know we are mortal people we are like a moth we are we are like a breath yeah we also uh we are things like that uh but to look at uh when we when we we also think that same way that you know when we look uh when we go 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 through the valley of shadow and the valley of death and the valley of fear and the valley of sickness and trials when we also we also Think that how a uh, 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 symbol we are, but uh, but on the other side, look at how much power and strength and authority and care and provisions God has given us. So let's keep in trust in the Lord. Remember that how marvelously He created us and He gave all the power and authority. Yes, we can see that. Uh, we can say the answer that uh, David had asked. asked and the verse 5, O oh Lord, uh, on, the, uh, on the fourth verse, what is mankind that you are mindful of them, human being that you are care for them. So we can answer that God is care for us. Yes, our life is matter to God. God loves each one of us as if there were only one of us to love. Thank you. May God bless you.